Um, ladies and gentlemen, our next speaker, who's going to be making his way to the stage, is um, Head of PhD International Central and Eastern Europe, Mr. Rupert Slate. Hello, everybody. How are we? Are we alive? Oh, I didn't hear that. Um, right, I'm about to start speaking, aren't I? Now, I'd like to first of all say that I am probably the most technologically illiterate person you'll ever like to meet. I am that typical managing director who screams at IT three times a day because I've locked myself out of my computer. I've forgotten my password. So why I'm speaking here, I don't really know. But I have worked in advertising for a very long time. And I worked in this region for a very long time. And in fact, back in um, 1998, I split up from a long-time girlfriend and I kind of joined my own foreign legion and went to Poland. And I said goodbye to everybody in the pub. I said, bye, see you, thinking I'd never, ever see these guys again. And I arrived in Poland. I had no smartphone, no internet. I just had to ring up this number and say, could you take me to the Irish pub? where I made a few friends, and it was all very sad. And then a few years later, of course, Facebook came. And I am a Facebook addict, dangerous Facebook addict. I have 870 friends, and I know them all. No, I don't. I know about half of them. But I chat to some of the others about football and things online for some bizarre reason. I am a Facebook addict. And in fact, I'm such a Facebook addict that my mother discovered that I was about to get married on Facebook. So for some joyous news, this is the final day of my honeymoon. And it's so nice to be sharing it with you today. I told my wife yesterday, yet today that we, she was going to be projected onto a giant, great big screen, and she had 50 fits. She said, you haven't asked me. You haven't asked me, but there I am. I got married two weeks ago. Thank you very much. Now, as a Facebook addict, I am in heaven. 